The breastplate that was worn by Aharon HaKoyhein, the high priest, was worn al libo on top of his heart. This breastplate was known as Mishpat, a source of judgment and guidance for the community, as the lettering on the breastplate would light up, and thereby the Kohen would know how to instruct the community. The commentators pick up on the wording, al libo on top of his heart. What does that actually mean? Well, they explain that the heart is a source of our emotions, of our feelings. And when it comes to judgment, the heart could be a problem. It could distort our judgment. The heart is what causes one to respect the wealthy man more, or to have more compassion for the poor man, thereby distorting the truth of judgment. When it comes to judging ourselves and assessing where I stand, what am I doing right and what am I doing wrong, often the heart can pervert my judgment. I end up doing things that are wrong or inappropriate because my heart pulled me, my emotion pulled me to do that. And so the verse is giving us the instruction that the source of mishpat, the source of judgment, the breastplate should be alibo on top of the heart. It should control the heart and make sure that it always remains faithful. A person remains faithful to God, to Torah and to true judgment. The heart is an important tool that we use often in the service of God. But it's only purposeful and useful when it's controlled by the moach, by the brain, by the intellect, by the truth and remaining objective. And so that's the instruction of the mishpat, of the choshen, of the breastplate, al-libo on the heart, ensuring the consistent emet, truth and objectivity when it comes to judgment of ourselves and of the community. Shabbat Shabbat.